the Ameritron AL811H with four valves 811A. They are uh, working quite nice in this amplifier. It is uh, together with the ICOM 7300 and the external speaker ICOM SP38. Here we have the instrument Diva CN801 which measure the power output of this amplifier. This amplifier has no instrument for output voltage so you need a power meter for this um, thing. So on the front panel you have two instruments one is for the plate current and one is for the grid current. These vents here it's for uh, hot air which is uh, going uh, here it's uh, going outside through these vents they are burning now uh, they are uh, quite bright and here is the uh, back of the amplifier um, the fan is not noisy it's a pleasure to to listen uh, to the radio there is not much noise and it's put easily 600 watts maximum power is 800 watts but for 700 watts it's 600 watts 700 watts it put it can put easily so we should show a little bit we have 30 watts output at the moment from the transceiver I don't know if it can see because the um, screen is bright and the camera can't see it and we have a look here on uh, the screen of the Diva power meter with the 30 watts output let's see how much output we can achieve so I will whistle a little bit on the band there is no propagation we are during the day so there is no propagation so we can't uh, we can do that no problem there is no QSOs on the band Seven hundred watts at the moment. Seven hundred watt. We will increase to the forty watts output. So we have um, about uh, eight hundred watts. Let's look on the instrument on the um, amplifier. Let's put a little bit higher. We will go to 45 watts input. Let's see how much we can achieve. we have easily 800 watts easily not easily but on the peak of the whistle we have 800 watts thank you very much bye bye